Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum and greetings, Ali Jamal here, and welcome to another fight of Ishin Adam RC Killer Whale. This time I have set it up with a temporary setup, like very quick setup that I did right here on the field, and uh, that is my favorite, personal favorite, SN Light flight controller, um, and my own personal favorite FPV combo. <laughs> Wow, look at that. It's very, very hands free. So, I can probably enjoy some FPV, but wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me just test the auto circle. Okay, hold on. Man, it's flying really nice and slow. So I'm just going to put it on auto circle. No, that was heading hold, sorry, it was on auto circle. So I'm going to come close, heading hold, and one moment, go towards the river more, auto circle. Throttle in the mid, slightly lower than mid, and a 200 meter radius circle. Now that is a big circle. It's gonna go over there. That's a very big circle. So I'm just gonna put it back to stabilize mode. You know, I said the 200 meter circle is just because I want to chase it with my DJI Mavic Air too. So I set a very big radius. I see a little bit left and right, like kind of nose hunting. We'll see from the video, onboard video. Okay, so I'm gonna put it into circle again. That's a very big circle, man. Very big circle. I can still see it. I don't know if the camera can see it or not, but I can see it. All right. It's doing its big circle. I should probably activate it right here over my head and I'll see how it goes. But I'm worried about the buildings. I have to be like kind of higher because you see the circle. Wow, that is big circle, man. So I'm gonna put it back to stabilize mode and test the auto return to home feature. Throttle to zero. It will climb to 160 meters when I do auto return to home. So I'm just gonna go a little farther in heading head mode, heading hold mode, activate RTH. You cannot see it, but I see it turning. And it's climbing up. Oh, more. It's climbing really fast and it's coming back. So. I will cancel and put it in auto circle which is again a very big radius now it's probably way above the buildings yeah and it's gonna turn around so no worries now I'm gonna go and enjoy some FPV okay I have no radio I just put the radio down and the plane is still flying and circling around. It has been over 9 minutes, 8.2 kilometers covered, draining 8, 9 amps, 10 amps sometimes, depending on how it's fighting the winds. 52 kilometers speed, 143 meters altitude, 142, 140. It's, it's staying in between there. It's actually flying very well, but it has a lot of like shaking around because of the turbulent wind today it's shaking and nose hunting left and right as well we gotta do some mods for this nose hunting probably we add some vortex generators 
and see if we can reduce it. On a calm wind day, it should be fine. It shouldn't do this this much, but on windy day, it's doing a whole lot of this nose hunting. But apart from this, it's flying very well, very stable, and so far, reliable? Let me see, where is it? Is it still flying? I don't hear it. Hold on. Oh, okay, is it still flying? <laughs> Coming back. 11 minutes, so I'll keep you posted how things go. Is flying on auto circles and I'm testing the FPV video goggles that is SkyZone SK04X OLED and I can tell you just listen to this I can tell you right now I have a patch antenna I have to point it towards the plane so that I get nice reception but man man that is some clear image I mean with the standard definition FPV system I am getting such a clear image hold on let me just start recording one two hold on let me just start recording and now it's recording so if I focus the thank you if I focus the patch towards the airplane look at that beautiful clear image and IPD adjustment autofocus is absolutely brilliant man it works really nice also to say that the original uh, receiver built-in receiver is doing a very very good job I was not expecting it to do such nice clear transmission so if I keep the you know patch antenna away from the plane let's say just put it here you can see my image is still pretty clear using the other uh, you know cluer leaf or using the other mushroom antenna the image is still very very clear and sometimes you see those grains coming but immediately the image merging from two different receivers like diversity is, is giving you a very very clear image right here so to say man I am really impressed by the performance of the SkyZone FPV video goggles. They are absolutely mm, charming FPV video goggles. Thank you very much SkyZone for releasing this. Okay, it's been, it's been 30 minutes since I'm flying and now battery is 14.7 so I better land, you know, also have people and don't tease the battery. It has been flying really long and really nice. So I'm very, very happy. We'll see when it lands how many kilometers we have accumulated now where is the wind coming from I have no idea so many people there Jangula. 
。好的。So bring it. 好的。So bring it down. Thirty-three minutes on the radio, but not on the plane. Beautiful landing, and my homemade landing gear brakes <laughs> worked superb. All right, man. Let's see what the OSD is saying. All right, so let's conclude this flight. It was really boring for me. I had nothing to do but just sit and wait, and time by time, check the OSD in the video goggles or on the LCD screen. So the plane flew half hour. When I landed, still there was 14.7 volts left in the battery. This means I could have pushed the battery slightly more, and that is a nice distance accumulated right there. Now, I will properly set up everything. Next thing, of course, I'm going to design a landing gear for it and 3D print it. And also uh, talk to the designer and see what we can do about this nose hunting. So stay tuned for next videos coming very soon to you on my channel. Don't forget to subscribe and give this video a big like. Come on, you know what to do. Hit that like button. It's right there. I know you can do it. Oh, while you're at it, also hit the subscribe button right there. Come on, don't be shy. Just hit it. Thank you very much for all your support. Towards my work, that I post regular and fresh content on my channel, just for you. Hit that like button.